Hello and welcome to my first Joomla 1.5 tutorial featuring a type of coding called CSS. I'm Mikey Tate with Inspired Technical Services and today, for all of you CSS students out there, I'll show you some basic CSS editing by changing the background color of the currently published template on my website. I already showed y'all how to add and install a template to your website, so go check out the video right now if you want to learn how to do so. Let's kick things off by logging into the back end of the Joomla website and on the extensions menu, click Template Manager. Here are all of the currently installed templates. If you want one of the templates displayed here, search for the author of the template using a search engine like Google, Yahoo, or Bing. Anyway, the little star here shows the currently published template. You can switch to a different template by clicking on the round thing here, and then click Default. The star will then change to the, to the template that you just switched to. Now, let's go to the settings of the currently published template. As you can see, there is not a single thing here to change. However, some templates will have a color option here where you can actually change the color of the template without the need of using your CSS skills. <laughs> but we are going to do just that though. So click Edit CSS and here here is the list of CSS files you can access. Since we are using the default template, we'll use the blue one. Now here's the catch. There's two of them here, but it will depend on what template you are using, so bear in mind that. Anyway, since we are editing the background color, let's do the blue background file, so click there and here, you'll see all the CSS coding. It helps the site to function properly. Now in this part of the coding, it tells you the exact location, location of the image file. If it's not there, then you won't be able to see it on the site. Now, this part here is the color code. This is where you can change the color of the background of your template. The background will depend on the template that you are using, which means some of the tips featured in, featured in this video will not be shown or, dis or discussed here. Now let's change the background using CSS. Let's say I prefer to have a white background over my blue default to Juma. All we have to do here is change the color code here to a certain code. Check with your search provider to see coding for all of the colors, if you want not only white. Now, the code for a white background is all six Fs, so all we, ha all we gotta basically do is change all of it to Fs. After we have done that, we can save the file here and look at our results. And here is our white background we did. But in order for it to work properly, make sure that the letters on the coding are lowercase. Now, there are all types of CSS that you can edit, like the fonts or the color of the fonts, too. And speaking of fonts, let's talk about the let's talk about editing HTML codes on my next tutorial. But right now, see you all there. Oh, and, oh, and subscribe to us if you enjoy watching our tutorials, or visit us online at www.inspiredtechnical.com. Bye for now.